this is Jock Dot. This is my second channel, apart from the music channel. This is the channel that's going to be one that has topics that are not musically centered. What does that mean? Well, that means you'll get things like your video game highlights video perhaps like in this case an entire football game with, with commentary it's just something that I felt like I want to do just something fun something a little out of the norm and it's just a little neat hobby a little something to do while I have the time to do it and I'll explain what's specifically going on right here. I'll try to get videos like this done every, oh, I don't know, maybe every week, every two weeks. There's nothing I can guarantee because you know, once school year starts, I'm kind of a busy guy. but. Uh, let me summarize what's going on right here. Uh, I started up a dynasty. I chose the Florida Gators. I don't really follow them in real life. I don't follow any college team very closely, but I just chose them because you know, it was a team that has spawned quite a few pro athletes. Just chose one. And I'm the coach. Just, I guess you could say I got it auto coaching. You know, I've got my my plan set up: offense, defense, um, all that comes with that. And this year, the 2028 season has my team off for the first two weeks. So week three is coming up. As you see, I'm. Simming week two, and we're going up against number four ranked Fresno State. We're ranked number two, or at least we will be. <laughs> Something happened <laughs> while we were not playing. But it's a cool game in and of itself, and if you pair it with Madden 12 where you can take the graduating classes and upload them into Madden 12 so it can get drafted. It's quite a neat deal. I mean, I had Madden 13. Never got NCAA 13, but I was displeased with Madden 13 because of the blurriness and it just seemed like the, uh, the players were just running into each other like crash test dummies. And that just overall wasn't really appealing to me so I did get ended up getting Madden 25 Madden 15 and just recently Madden 16 painfully behind I'm sure but you know it is what it is yeah and you see the uh, stats for the one game Fresno State has played so far and if I remember correctly, the year before, Fresno State won the championship. And I think we ended up playing them and they beat us. And I'm setting them both up. Both teams play the pro set on offense. And we are maybe a minute away from our first game of the 2028 season kicking off real quick one rundown of my general my general team 
Tends to be really strong on the run. Passing game comes through in some moments. Um, my quarterbacks tend to run very well. Defensively, I mean, almost always it seems like number one against the run. And for that reason, we give we tend to have a lot of passing yards. Well, why? Because nobody can run against us. Special teams, you know, my, my kickers constantly winning the Groza Award. Kick returners, I think I've, I think I've had a kick returner win maybe two awards. Hmm. But I think I've won five, I think I've won five championships. So we definitely have some kind of a dynasty going. And this year I have a defensive tackle on the 99. I think his last name is is Gin or Gin G I N N. And he is a power force in the middle. And in fact, I found an NCAA 12 for some reason is just like overly strong. And the defensive tackles and there's Blake Johnson there. Quarterback 6'2", 181. Okay, good height, but my goodness, he's skinny. He's less than 200 pounds. And this game is brought to you by Sparks. It's raining. And maybe we'll have a game that's mostly running. But we'll see. And my team is kicking off nine minute quarters. Any more than that, I found that it's, it's just too much. It's just completely uh, unrealistic. It wasn't to my liking. So that explains the uh, nine minute quarters. So Fennel State has the ball on the 27 yard line. Great pocket throws and it's nearly picked off. Try to get it to Garnett. It, uh, he was covered. Second down and 10. I had that deflected. Under center this time. Hand off and he is down. Negative two for you. And there's that guy I was talking about. 99, that's, that's again. He's already making an impact. So now we have our first third down situation. Shotgun, man in motion. Throws over the middle, and it is caught for a first down. He, he found a soft part in our defense, 15 yards. I would say a little bit more about the Fresno State players, but Fresno State doesn't put the names on the back of at least their away uniform so it's kind of tough to commentate the way I would like to otherwise unless I overhear the, uh, the stadium announcer say the name okay under center two left two right play fake rolls left a little bit and he's going to pull it down he's got the first down Good job by Johnson. He's got 12 yards of messing them on his jersey. First down. So the Fresno State is moving. They've got an early drive here. And you see why they rank so high. Strong, strong offense. Very resourceful quarterback. Okay, this time it's trips left. First 10. And he throws. And somehow he got behind the entire defense. Looked like a blown coverage to me. Touchdown, Fresno State. <laughs> and you see the uh, mascot, the Bulldog, having a good old time in the rain. Kick is up and good. Johnson to Barnett, 44 yards and a touchdown on a sixth play. 72-yard drive and a minute 25 off of the clock. Doesn't take long in college football. Is uh, the time clocks are 
operated a little bit differently. And Miller returned that kick 17 yards up to the 22-yard line, it looks like. I formation, first down, and the handoff. Oh, great blocking. Eight yards right off the bat. That's encouraging. Well, take it back. It's seven. Knock off a yard. Second down and three, and they run right to that same hole again. First down. They found themselves a sweet spot. Great offensive lineman. Always great offensive lineman. Helps to have it on auto recruit. And here is, oh no, I thought he was going to pitch on it. He ran over a guy. And somehow Williams got four yards. Man, this guy is tough. Keep in mind, this guy is a red shirt sophomore. He did quite a bit as a freshman. Handoff off a of right tackle. First down. So it's like Florida's offense is taking off pretty well. Haven't thrown the ball yet. Oh, man, this is a driving rainstorm. Always a, a great ground game. Passing here and there. Not bad. Not, not, not super excellent, but serviceable. Okay, and there's Wilson. If I remember correctly, Wilson is about... Six foot one and 230. So he packs a punch when he runs. And there's Wilson again running out of the gun. And he has caught. Well, they say a loss of one, but they say it's third down and 10. So officially no gain. Okay, out of the shotgun. Man in motion. Williams looking out of pocket. Throws. And he's got a man. Inside the 25 yard line. And as soon as I can find out who this player is, I will definitely tell you. Uh, that is, looks like Miller, number 85. Gotta find out who is going to be the number one receiver for this Gator team this year. Now they are a driving. Hand off behind right guard, and he's still on his feet. Oh, look out. Oh, hold on. That's Dixon. Let's look at this again. He's even bigger than the starter. Okay, he got a couple of blocks. That block from number 87 spun around. Made number 24 look silly. And he cruised into the end zone for a touchdown. Setting up for the extra point. Kick is up. Kick is good. So it's tied at seven. A 23-yard run by Dixon caps off an eight-play, 77-yard drive, 222. Burned off of the clock. And these two top five teams are squaring off very well, looking very much like a top game. Oh, and the kick returner is down. Hope he's okay. Hope it's just a temporary wound. Tight end in motion, first down. Quarterback under center. Short drop, throws, and oh my goodness, that was nearly picked off by Webster, number 21. Gators looking at Webster to be the leader in that secondary. It's a good secondary. Hand off around right in. Oh, he jumps over one player, and then he is plucked out of the air by number 95. And don't know his name, but something tells me we're going to find out. Third down and 13 now. Shotgun formation at their own 30. Oh, and he is sacked. Fumble, sacked by Ginn, and let's see who recovered it. 
as the Gator Band plays. Let's look at it again. It was a high snap. He brought it down and again hit him high on the left shoulder, non-throwing shoulder. And number 90. I don't know his name. We covered it for the Gators. So now Florida is on the 23-yard line. Oh, it's a short flat pass caught by Long, number 82. And it was very flat. In fact, no gain. Quickly brought down. Oh, handoff. Oh. And Wilson only got two yards behind left guard that time. Third down and eight. And they'll come out in the shotgun. Play fake. Oh, sacked. Oh, my goodness. Number 63 just beat the right tackle. Just far too quick. So now it's fourth and 14. Ball is at about the 27, 34. So the 44-yard field goal attempt. And he nailed it. Beach got it over the crossbar. And that's four plays, negative four yards, 103 off of the clock. And it's it's odd to see, a, I don't know if you call it a drive, it's a possession. Become a scoring drive. Oh, good return here up to about the 27-yard line. Yep, nose of the ball, right at the 27-yard line. 3.27 left to go in the opening quarter. And there's a pitch out to the left side. Oh, he's bumped backwards. And he is brought down inside their own 20. Ooh. My goodness. And number 59 brought him down. Behind, way behind the line of scrimmage. He broke one tackle. It knocked him back. So that, all told, that's a loss of 10. Second down and 20. Handoff up the middle, and he has popped. Boy, there's number 59 again. This defense is just loaded with talent. This is a Sellers, no, Stallings, number 59, and number 85. Sharing some words there. Third down and 18. Quarterback under center. Long drop throws deep. To the near side, to the left side, and it is nothing doing. Out of bounds, and it's fourth down. So the line scrimmage at their own 18. They punt it, and it's a good punt, taken out about the 4 to 35 by Wilson. And the ball is at. The 41 and a half yard line. Pitch out to the left. He got a fullback blocking for him, and it works out. He's got about eight yards. Number 72 and number 20. There's that was Clayton, number 22, the fullback, making one of the kickout blocks, and it got Wilson eight yards. That's pretty good stuff. But that's what Florida does. Primarily a running team, even though they're in the gun a lot of the time. Oh, incomplete. In and out of his hands. Number 85. Yep, third down and two. Now in the center, eye formation. Play fake. And it's going to throw over the middle. Oh. And that's Heath, number 85. So two straight drops. Can't say he wasn't given an opportunity. And it's fourth down. They will punt this one away. Take him at about the 13. And maybe gets up to about the, oh, okay. To about the 17 and a half yard line. 
A first down, they come out in the eye. Pitch out to the left side. And he's got a little bit of running room. Seven yards. And number 45. Second down and three. Three wide. Back to pass. Looking. And he's got Allen. Number 10. He's been the primary receiver so far today. Boy, he takes a hit. Wow. But he gets up. Can't tell he even got hit. So now the ball is at the 37-yard line. Four wide gun. And there's Allen. He's got the first down. He's still running. Inside the 35-yard line. He's got a pair of quick feet, ran a slant pattern, and he is so fast that uh, he found a gap in the secondary and nearly broke it for six. 10-7, Florida, 106 and counting, left to go in the open quarter of play. Tight end in motion, left to right. Quarterback back to throw, he throws on the left flat to the fully. And about a gain of four yards, stepped out of bounds. Let's see what they do here. Florida got a lot of guys up near the line. Looks like man set out of the gun, and, and number 45 runs, and he gets about three. Thomas, number 95, made the tackle. Third down and three. Let's see if they can keep this drive alive. Man in motion, quarterback under center, and handoff up the middle, and that is another first down. They cannot get this offense off of the field right now, looks like. Nice drive in that run. Three wide. Oh, he slips as he throws over the middle, and it is intercepted. Oh. And the band played on. Florida Gators. Intercepted by number 48. Trying to read a name on the back of his jersey, but it's, it's not happening. <laughs> Even on the highlights. So the ball at the 15 yard line. Handoff on first down. Gets across the 15, and wait a minute, there's a flag. Mm. That's on Bobby Sears, the left tackle. So back him up. First down and 18. And with, well, I don't think they'll... I don't think they'll get another playoff, and they won't. It's the end of the first quarter. Florida leading 10-7. You see those highlights, and you can bet your bottom dollar we're going to have a whole lot more than that. So we start about their own eight. Run right up the middle, safe run. Four yards, four yards there. By Wilson. Puts him up to the 12 yard line. This time out of the shotgun. And a throw over the middle, hey, he breaks a tackle. And lands in the SEC logo. <laughs> nice job there by Williams and Miller connecting. Look for half second like he would take that one all the way. And that is a danger of both of these offenses. They have guys who can take it to the house on any given play. First down run right up the middle. And that is a gain of four yards for Wilson. They look for him to be the next great back. 
and they have plenty of them They're at this proud university second down to six counter play and they might want to put that back on the counter that didn't work that was negative one trying to go up the middle third down and seven three wide receivers Williams looking looking throws to the left side and oh my goodness that should have been picked off by number 29 poor choice but very fortunate he didn't have that one run back for a pick six and this punt will be taken at the 30 across the 35 to the about the 38 yard line or so let's see yep about the 38 and a half handoff on first down look out blowing right up the middle oh. 21 yards on first down right up the gut and uh and what do you do if you're Florida? I mean, this team can do whatever it wants to do, pass or run with equal or plum. You can't double cover anybody. Hand off, try to go off right tackle, and they shut the door on that. That's not happening. This Florida Gator team year after year is amongst the top five in rushing defense right up the middle they go though oh great block 11 yards and thomas had to bring him down from behind as uh you see the mascot of almost at florida state fresno state he's enjoying it obviously so they're on Florida side of the field and off right tackle look out he's got a block and he is in for the touchdown number 88 on the end around got a couple of good blocks that sprung him loose and that's exactly what I was talking about any play that they choose it makes sense to run it because they have the guys to run each and every play that they have in that playbook. 30 yard run by Johnson. Four plays, 62 yards, 55 seconds. 14 to 10, Fresno State. Taken at about the five, plus 15 to 20. The 25 runs into trouble at about the 26. Decent job there by Wilson. Ball at the 26-yard line. Man in motion on the eye. And there's Wilson. He breaks one tackle. Cannot break the two others. And it's only two yards. Wilson not finding the room that his counterpart is finding. He was second down. I'll try to quick pass to the right side. Smith was there to bat that ball down. Now it's a third down and eight situation. They're in the gun. And they run from the gun. And they gain zero yards. So they would have to give it back to the Bulldogs. Nice punt. All the way back to about the 30, the 35 to 40. And he's at about the 43 before he's even touched. Five for the one left to go in the first half. Bulldogs up by four. First down out of the eye, running right up the middle again. You got to be kidding me. Touchdown. Fresno State. Well, it certainly seems like they have found the way into the end zone, and it is right up the middle. 
where Gin resides, and everybody knows about his pass rushing ability. Uh, good, good guy against the run, but not infallible. Kick is up and good. 21 to 10 now. Fresno State making their case here at the Swamp. Kickoff across the 20, up to about the 22, maybe 23. Let's see where they mark it. Oh, wow. Up to the 24. Five wide on first down. And it is caught by Heath, and Heath makes a big play there. Florida first down, and I'm a little surprised that he went to Heath, seeing that first two targets, the ball hit him in his hands, and it just, just dropped. A little bit of redemption. Hand off out of the eye. And Wilson. Wow, Wilson has a lot of power. He is a strong runner. And would love to see what he does for the rest of this year. One can only imagine the stats. Second down and two is a gain of eight. Now the shotgun draw play, and there's Wilson. He's got the first down. Four yards off a of right tackle. Getting more yards off of the tackles, and they are going inside. And there's right tackle again for Wilson, and Wilson plows ahead for about six. 15 carries, 57 yards for Wilson so far in the ball game. Want to get that average up a little bit. 3.8. Play fate. Williams throws over the middle and it is picked off. And down at about the 30 yard line. Oh, brother. Can't throw late over the middle. Tried to get it to the tight end. And. He was in effect double covered. So Fresno State <laughs> gets the ball back. Man, these, these turnovers are starting to add up just a little bit. Hand off to the fullback, and, and he is smashed in the mouth. He gets one, but it wasn't a fun run for him. So the ball is at the 31. Two tight end set. Oh, left one in motion goes into the slot. Handoff up the middle, and he's got fat yardage again. Oh, that's a 10 yard gain. Another first down. Oh, Fresno State is a machine. First down and 10 at about the 41 yard line out of the eye up the middle and this time they only get one yard handing off to number 45 up the middle finally closing that highway off so to speak on the center quick throw to Allen to the left side and Latimer made the tackle it's third down and two just short of the midfield strike. Third down and two. Oh, he slips, but he is quick enough to put that ball down, or pull it down, rather, and run right up the middle. And there's Ginn and the quarterback talking smack, I'm sure. Talking about the weather. <laughs> so, first down. Oh, the shotgun play fake and a quick throw. And <laughs> Latimer, uh, man down Pena. And Dwight Johnson, 8 of 12, just got over the 100 yard passing mark. 
Second down and five. Handoff out of the gun. And Meyer, number 45, got four yards. It just it's just amazing. Third down and one. They have to get to the 35. Johnson throws and it is caught by Morton. And they are at about the let's see. 34 yard line. Handoff off of right. Uh oh, look out. Oh my goodness. Holy moly. They are just spanking Florida. Right off a of right tackle. Don't know don't know who number 43 is. But we're about to find out. Wow. This is a mean team. Kick is up. And good. So 33 yards by Mac. Caps a nine play 70 yard drive. 234 off of the clock. And with a minute 40 left in the first half, it is 28 to 10 Fresno State. Let's see if the Florida Gators can answer this one. Across the 20. Down, let's see. Well, let's see what they officially mark. I think he got to the 23. Okay. He got to 24. And again on first down, they go five wide. And throw goes over the middle, and there was a lot of Fresno State jerseys. He's making some dangerous throws now. He's got to calm down. Out of the gun. Being pressured and cannot sail the ball over the Fresno players. Couldn't get it to Miller. So now it's third down and 10. They have to pass in order to get this first down. And he's going to go deep. And he's got a man. Hold on. Look out. Burn, baby, burn. The Florida Gators just scored a long distance touchdown. Well, you just don't let those wide receivers get behind you because that is exactly what would happen. You get embarrassed in front of not only the people in the stadium, but everybody who is at home watching, those listening on the radio. Big audience for embarrassment. The kick is up and good. So Williams to Jacobs, 76 yards. Capping a three play, 76 yard drive. 20, not 20 minutes, 20 seconds off of the clock. And this was a short kickoff. Woo. Roy Smith got popped. Roy Stallings, number 59, down there on special teams. And the ball is officially at about the 28-yard line. So first down, back to throw, and he is going to be sacked by number 20. First time out of the ball game, called by uh, Fresno State. Second down and 17 now. Quick drop. He gets back there quickly, but somehow he broke tackles to get three yards. And Florida just called a timeout. But they're quickly back out there. Third down and 14. And Williams throws deep. And it's picked off. Oh, and Webster stepped out of bounds after a minimal gain on the return. But uh, an interception is an interception. Can't take that away from them. And now Florida has... A chance to somehow, at least by a field goal draw, closer. Oh, my goodness. Tried to force feed that to Heath. Double covered. Now it's second down and 10. Ball resting at the 45. And a throw to Heath. He makes the catch this time for seven yards. Timeout called by Florida. 
Third down and three. Pitch out to the right side. And Wilson breaks a tackle. He's still on his feet. Down out of bounds, I think, about near the 40-yard. No, 30-yard lines. Excuse me. Heck of a run. Four wide. And quick throw to the tight end. Riley made the tackle. And it's second down and seven. Quickly to the line. And this is Jacobs making the catch there. 28 seconds. And oh, uh oh, there's a flag. And there's a throw. Incomplete. Deflected. But I think somebody was offsides. Yep. That was Mark Reynolds, number 94, the defensive tackle. He got caught. 23 seconds left to go in the first half. Now, first down and five. They only have to get to the one-yard line. Changing the play up. And Williams pulled it down. I'm sure he regrets that now. It's a gain, or, or rather a loss of five yards. Second down and ten. And quick throw to Wilson. And Wilson popped at about the ten. Timeout call, and they'll get the special teams units out there on the field. The kick is up, and it is good. Smart idea. So now they draw within eight. Florida Gators out here in this rain. 27 yard field goal by Beach. Eight plays, 45 yards. Took less than a minute. Short kickoff again across the 20 to the 25 up to about the 30, but let's see what happened. Ooh, that's Kyle Johnson, the right guard. End of the half. Okay. So there you have it. Half number one down. Fresno State 28, Florida 20. And I can tell you that this Fresno State team is no joke. They've recruited well. And uh, <laughs> this team is for real. Second half action started already. Oh, look out. Got a block. Still on his feet. Wilson breaks the tackle. Touchdown. Wow. If that doesn't get your team excited about coming back, I don't know what does. Wilson just burned that far sideline. Broken arm tackle. And just took it to the house. And it looks like they're going to go for it. Four wide and a shotgun. Williams throws and it's caught. Tie ball game. Wow. 28 all. And the kickoff return. But to the I think about the 24. Let's see where they actually mark it. Oh, the 25. It's a better, slightly better return than what I thought. Out of the, oh! 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 Seven yard loss. And Thomas knocked him to the ground. Had a little bit of help there from number 61, but boy, Thomas planted him see the Bulldog players showing their uh, disgust over that second down and 17 now back to pass throws to the flat it's caught but it's uh, going to be a third down and eight situation They'll have to pass. 
and that shouldn't worry them too much. They haven't, well, they did throw the one interception to Webster, but other than that, they've been clean. Third down and eight. The throw to the far side. Batted down. And it is fourth down. They have to punt this one away. And this one's kind of a knuckler. <laughs> 35 yard punt. Seven yard return, as the man said, and it is tied. Let's see how they call the plays. It being a tie ball game at this point. And the throw is picked off. Smith made the interception. Tried to get it to number 85 and just more often than not, it has not been an enjoyable experience doing that. Oh. Wow, David Meyer, 112 yards already. And of course, he scored a touchdown. Second down and four. I'm going to give it to him again. Wow, look at that power. Ooh. He can take a hit. He just put those shoulders down and just barrel through. And now the ball is at the Fresno State 45, and they're going to give it to him again behind right guard and tackle, and got a whole lot of nothing. Well, you run enough, and you're going to have those those runs when you don't get anything. And delay draw. And there again, and that's going to be a loss. Ah, and oh, 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 wait a minute. He's still on the ground. So we're going to have a subby. Third down to 13. Trips right. And uh, draw for the Miller. Just played it safe for some reason. I do not get that play call. That is about as conservative as it gets almost. Fourth and 13. Yeah, decent punt taking about the 15-yard line and hit about the 20. That's Wilson. Ball about the 21-yard hmm, line. Man in motion. Hand off up the middle out of the eye. There's Wilson. Wilson cuts back inside. Tries to twist away from some Bulldogs and Nonetheless, he got a first down. Boy, nice job there. O-line. Getting some stalemates going, I guess you could say. And tight end emotion on first down and 10 here. Two tight ends to the right side, and that's where they run. And that's Wilson gaining five yards. Second down and five. Up to the 37. Handle. Oh, big hole. First down again. Eight yards. Wow, look at all that room. He had choices. My goodness. The Sparks on the 72. Rated by this game as... Florida's best player, actually. Most talented player. And Wilson, forget about it. Oh. A negative three. Sparks tried to shove the guy out of the way and just really pushed him back into the uh, running lane. It's a rare mistake by Sparks. Second down and 13. Man, the motion out of the eye. Pitch out to the right side. And there's Wilson. And ooh, he is met. Hello. He only got one yard out of that. Nice aggressive play there from Smith. 
Coming from his position in the secondary. Third down and 12 out of the shotgun. Williams throws over the middle and he's got a man. You gotta be kidding me. Oh. It happened again. Somebody is making some horrible mistakes in deep coverage, as in somebody's assuming there's somebody else going to take over that. What a burn. What a burn. Now Florida's back in the lead. Kick is up. Kick is good. 4.37 left to go in the third quarter. Williams to Jacobs again, this time for 58 yards. Six plays, 80 yards, 140 off of the clock. And it's 35-28 Gators. This one taking about the eight-yard line. And a little bit of help there. And let's see. Ooh, that's Anthony Young, the tight end, who's guilty. And uh, strong as this offense is, and with all the time, there shouldn't be any shouldn't be any anxiousness. And uh, ooh, handoff up the middle. He ran right into Ginn and bounced backwards. Second down and nine. Out of the eye. Hand off. Oh. He only got two yards this time. Boy, this, so far, Myers finding it rough going. He's starting to shut it down in the middle. Third down and seven coming up. And a throw to the right side and there was a whole lot of nobody there waiting on that catch fourth down and seven and this punt is returned shortly <laughs> not a lot there So I'm thinking they'll just keep giving him a whole lot of Wilson, and then sure enough, there he goes. Although he didn't get anything there. I run a lot, pass here and there. But that's their strength. Just going with their strengths and just not doing anything silly. Oh! Oh, man. Well, <laughs> good and bad news for him he didn't get tackled but the uh, potential tackler knocked him backwards and momentum made him lose yards negative three in fact third down and 13 looks like they're going to blitz let's see how they handle that they handle it but there was nobody making a catch well, I don't know who he is throwing to so now it's fourth and 13. So both quarterbacks make third down throws at a spot there where there is no one. <laughs> so short punt, short return. So now it's Florida. I did it again. <laughs> There's no state's ball. Play fake, caught. Norton, 11-18 for 141 yards. Dwight Johnson, eight yards on the play, second down and two. Took the high snap and just did get it away, and there's Meyer on the screen pass. Five yards. Had to cut it back inside because there's just too much traffic. Outside, first down and 10. Oh, Johnson will keep it, and he will earn a headache. Negative one on that play. They were all over it. When he has 
kept the ball. It has been a mixed bag. Oh, somebody jumped. Looked like. Let's see what the flag is all about. Outside's on the defense. That's number 95, Joe Thomas. Well, they say if you're going to have a penalty on you on defense, at least it make it an aggressive penalty, and that's an aggressive penalty. Second down and six. Oh. And that's White, number 90, sacking the quarterback, trying to run out of the backfield, and he just could not get it done. White was just too quick for him. You see that look quite often from that bench. Third down and 10. And it's a draw play. Fine job of not letting that one get away from him. And it's fourth down. You have to punt. Oh, wait a minute. It's a fake. Knocked away. They tried to get them flat-footed or, or catch them flat-footed, and it just did not work. Nice job of being aware by the Florida Gators. And the ball is just two yards short of the 50-yard line. And he's going to keep it this time. Oh, he breaks the tackle, cuts back inside. All told, he's got seven yards. And... Um, in case you don't know, Williams is a pretty good runner. He can uh, he can bring it. He's had some excellent runs last year. Oh, and he's going to be sacked this time, though. Loss of nine yards. He got drilled. Oh. Now it's Florida's bench. It's time to, to have the sad looks. Third down and 12. Less than a minute to go here in the third quarter. Back to throw. Looking, looking, and he's going to. Oh, my goodness. He nearly got sacked. Just to get that ball away. Oh. <laughs> On top of that, Jacob slipped running the route. So it was just all kinds of chaos going on. This wasn't meant to be. Fourth down and 12. And this punt is going to be taken inside the 15. And will be returned not much further than that. Excellent job of return coverage. And the ball is placed at the 17. And a pitch out. Oh, nice job of pitching that one out. And I believe they got the first down out of it. Wow. 11 yards. Well-timed pitch. And I'm not sure what number 55 was thinking. Looks like he was running in quicksand. A few seconds left to go in the third quarter. Fresno has the ball. Trips right this time on first down and 10. And they will run it. There's Meyer trying to go to the right side, and he got four. And that would be the last play of the third quarter. One more to go here on ESPN College Football, brought to you by EA Sports and Jock Doc. Also brought to you by Coke Zero, I see. One more quarter. Second and sixth situation, they're running out of the eye, and the ball is loose. Florida ball. And there's Thomas. And uh, says so number 94, I mean 54 rather, I mean I didn't get to read his name. And you see, you see they're getting a little, a little frustrated there. You can send something bad coming on. Here's Jet Sweep. And Jacobson gets swept under the rug. Negative one on that play. 
Try a different play. Second down and 11. Let's see what they do. Two tight ends set. One tight end goes to the right. Williams fading back to... No, he doesn't get the pass. He would get planted. Wow, that's the fourth sack on him. Three hurries and a knockdown. So he's taking his share of bumps and bruises. Third down and 19 coming up here. The ball on about the 39 of Fresno. Looking, looking, throwing out of the pocket. And oh my goodness. Had Gilbert there at a tight end as well as one of the wide receivers. And both of them just neglected to say, I got it. And the kick is up. Oh my goodness. That didn't have enough leg. First miss of the day for Beach. Much to the happiness of the Bulldog bench. And they come out in the eye again. They're starting to run out of the eye a little bit more. And he just throws that one away. Didn't see what he wanted to see. Didn't hold on to the ball. So... an intelligent move out of the broken eye oh Meyer tried to run out of, out of the back out of left, from left tackle rather and um, he got a welcoming committee third down and ten you hear the crowd looking Johnson looking long wow a lot of time and throws over the middle and it is caught by Allen Uh, did I say Allen? I think it's Barnett. Anyway, number 10. That guy. He was silent for a little while after making a few catches in the first quarter, I believe. But that's a big play there. Wow. Out of the eye. Oh. No gain on that play. They're not letting me have it. So it's second down and 10. Ball at the 21, I believe. And oh, they're going to run out of the gun. A little pitch out. And they're going to lose five yards. Oof. The pursuit for both of these defenses is nasty. Third down and 15. Looking, looking, throwing deep into his own, and it is that away. Oh my goodness. Woo. And it's going to be fourth down and 15. And a kick from the, let's see, what, 33? So it's going to be a, about a 43 yard attempt. And the kick is up and good. 35 31 now. And it is still raining. Lacey from 43 yards, seven plays, 35 yards. Wilson back to receive this one. Can we make it two touchdowns? Ooh, oh my gosh. He will not. Let's look at the game track. They've been putting some hurt on number two here and there. run a little bit but for the most part he's been getting popped especially by this guy Marcus Gunn two and a half sacks five tackles total three TFLs the man is out there working and working hard and getting results let's see if he can stop this drive first down and ten handoff up the middle Ooh, forget about it and it's one yard gain. Second down coming up here. Uh oh, they got trips left. And he's going to go deep. He's going to go to the weak side of it. Oh. And he tried to get it to Miller, but that ball sailed out of bounds. And on top of it, 
who was covered like a blanket. That was not going to happen. Oop. See some good football today. Not without mistakes, but you see some pretty good plays. Third down and nine. In the pocket. Pop! Sacked! Loss of eight yards there. Well, Florida State 63 beat Florida 63. And just really laid Williams down to the ground <laughs> in a rude way. Well, so it's fourth down. Deep in their own territory. They're going to have to punt this one away. And this. Oh, that's not a good punt. Mm. Out of bounds at the midfield stripe. Oh boy. You're giving this offense a fairly short field. I'm going to have to go 50 yards for a touchdown. And as they go on first down, look at this here. Oh, they're gobbling up the yards. Ooh, 21 yards. That's the second time that. He has done that jet sweep, and this one he went for 21. That is a big chunk of yardage. He's going to pull it down. He's going to run. And Stallings was there to put the whack on him, but he's got six yards nonetheless. So, uh, Mr. 181 pounds gets up and shows that he can take it. And Johnson throwing deep. Did he? No. No catch. Third down and four. And, oh, a spin move, and he's got the first down. Nice job by Meyer. He's got. 10 yards and a first down. Well, this is what I was talking about. You just cannot give these guys that sort of a field. And here's give to Meyer. He'll lose a yard. Let's see who can still slug it out. And the throw to the right side is going to be tipped away. Webster was there. And Johnson thought he can throw it over them. Just could not. Just did not have the right touch on the ball. And now the shotgun on third down and 11. He throws into the end zone. And this one is good. Touchdown. In the back of the end zone, he got two feet. That would have been good in the NFL. Wow. Excellent job of body control. Nice footwork. And the kick is up and good. So Johnson to Barnett. 13 yards, seven plays, 49 yard drive. A minute and a half off of the clock. Now, the pressure is on Florida. Can they score? Can they regain the lead? As Wilson got to the 25. And uh, you see some of the beatings that Williams has taken thus far. Scoring a lot of points, but... The ribs are hurting, I promise you. Five sacks on them. And they're looking to put some more damage on them. Trying to wear him down. Trips left on first down and 10. Clean pocket. About to break down, but he throws this one deep. And that should have been picked. I tried to get it to Collins, but... Uh, I went right to a uh, red and white shirt. So it's going to be second down, fortunately. 
for the Gators. Four oh six left to go in the game. And Fresno State is up by only three. Look out! Oh my goodness. Boy. Miller had a laser shot on him. Put him to the ground again. They just did not pick up the blitz. And now it's third down and 18 inside their own 20. Now they're going five wide. And a pass is thrown. Jakeson makes the catch. But uh, not nearly enough for the first down. I uh, don't believe they will go for it here. It's too early. It's late <laughs> for me. Fourth down and four. And they're taking their time here. I see. I guess trying to burn off some of the clock. But the thing is, they don't have the lead. Mm. <laughs> A 37-yard punt. And right up the middle. Blair brought him down, but that's seven yard gain for Mr. Meyer and there was just no linebacker there to fill the gap in time and he had three down linemen there Johnson making an adjustment and I guess they're going to just do that two second snap just to burn time off the clock and Maybe get out of here with even just a three-point win. And, oh, oh, look out. There's a flag. Hmm. That's Ryan Harrison, number 76. All right, guard. Other than that, I guess we'll say he's doing fairly well. So now it's second down and 13. Trips left while well, they have one guy in motion now. So they're gonna let it I guess go down to two seconds. And they do. He's gonna pull it down. And he got three yards. Timeout by the Gators. Shotgun formation here, third down and ten. Oh, all over. Everybody knew they were going to run. And the punt taken. And <laughs> uh, Donnie Beach, 203. Made that long one of 44 and missed on the long one. Just. I just a question of leg strength. And with six and counting left to go. And Williams throws. And did he catch it? Yes. Yes, he did. Wow. Deep corner out. And he, he was actually well covered. Oh, hold on. Wait a minute. This might be... This might be brought back. Let's see. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's a... That is a clean catch. All right. So, Miller makes a huge play to keep these guys alive. And a throw by Williams, and it is picked off. Oh, boy. 
Ooh. And that is number 40, Vincent's second pick. So Williams has thrown three interceptions. And this has to be the worst one. No, Fresno State doesn't have to do a whole lot from this moment on. As Florida, yep, just spent their third and final time out. The rest of it's gravy. Run a play and just boil it down to two every single time. Run it and just don't fumble. Uh, in fact, uh, I don't know why they're not kneeling down. Third down and 11. This, could, this conceivably could be the last play that they have to run. They boil this down to two seconds and snap it. What a game to lose if, uh, if you're Florida. And back and forth. It went early on. But my goodness. Oh, hold on. Oh. Thomas. With the sack. Oh, boy. Fourth down and 17. And that very well may be the last play of the ball game. What a game. What a game. And that will be it. It's official. Fresno State goes to 2 and 0 as they defeat the Florida Gators at the Swamp 38 to 35. It was not a perfect game, but there were some fantastic plays and this was voted the play of the game right up the middle Meyer went. And yep, as the Gator fans get up and go home or wherever they want to go, uh, the coaches meet in the middle of the field. A good game. Florida goes to 0 and 1. And John Barnett, he's the player of the game. Six catches, 147 yards, and a touchdown. And that man there, he didn't play a bad game either. You see these highlights. Hit and one of the two touchdowns that Meyer scored. And I believe this is the throw that was a deep catch for, yeah, for uh, Jacobson. And man, he just burned them. A lot of mistakes defensively, but there's no made fewer. And this was. This was a crazy one. That was a heck of a kickoff return. Took it to the house to open the second half. And then Jacobs with another long touchdown catch. Heck. Could have made a case for him being the player of the game if his team had won. Oh, I hate it when the graphics do that. There you go. First foray into this thing, and I'll be trying to get more for you. Cause I really enjoy these. It's a really, really good game. Let's see, get the stats going. Uh, let's see, player stats. All right. 
Davis Williams. See, my player is skinny too. He's just a little bit taller. 6'3", 183. 13-28, 266 yards, two scores, three picks. And then Wilson was just two yards short of a 100-yard game himself. And Steven Jacobs is just a sophomore, man. I have kids here. Sophomore, four catches, a buck 63, two scores. Man, he's going to be all right. And uh, you see these guys here. Gave up a lot of stuff here. And Joe Thomas, he was a beast. Six TFLs. Derek White led with two sacks. And he was a junior. Webster, Ben Brown, making the picks. Russell Webster and Latimer deflecting. And sophomore, so making plays. He's got some kids making plays. And Donnie Beach. Lee Wilson getting it done. And there's uh, Johnson for Fresno State. Look at that, 142 yards against my boys. Oh my goodness! And Johnson two for 51. A freshman just coming in and just blowing up. Barnett, player of the game. These guys give up the sacks. Curtis looked like he's leading tackler for that team. And John Hayes, TFLs, two and a half sacks for him. Marcus Gunn, two and a half sacks. Brian Vincent, a sophomore, wow. Playing a great game. Curtis. Uh, this I hope you guys enjoyed it. I mean, it's fun for me. This is pretty cool. And I'll be seeing you guys maybe on this channel next, maybe next week. Depends if I've got something musically going. Go to my it's my first channel. This is my second channel. So. See you guys later. Press that like button. Subscribe. If you guys like this, let me know. And I will talk to you guys. Give me some more of this stuff.